Google Play Store app may sometimes encounter hiccups. In this video we'll provide the solutions that you can try if your Galaxy S10 Play Store app is not downloading updates or apps. First, reconnect internet connection. Checking your internet connection is a must in this case. Most of the time Play Store errors are caused by intermittent or slow internet. If you're on cellular or mobile data, try to connect the device to a strong Wi-Fi network. If Google Play Store is not downloading when you're connected to your own Wi-Fi network, you may need to troubleshoot your Wi-Fi first. Next, restart device. Rebooting the device itself can sometimes help in dealing with Play Store errors. This happens if the cause of the problem is due to a minor bug after leaving a device running for a long time. Try restarting it normally first by pressing the power button to access the boot menu, then select restart option and see if that works. Next, Reset Download Manager. Android devices have a special app called Download Manager that automatically manages all download-related stuff. Sometimes this app may encounter a bug that affects other apps. Next, Force Quit. Restarting Play Store may help if the app is not opening or downloading. Next, clear app cache and data. Wiping Play Store app cache is another way in fixing problems with it. Like any app, Play Store may encounter slow performance or other issues due to a corrupted cache. A good follow-up troubleshooting step in this case should be to delete the app's data. This will reset the app to defaults. Next, verify date and time of device is correct. Google Play Store app may not work if the system date and time of a device is wrong. Next, check available storage. If Google Play Store is still not downloading at this time it can be due to lack of internal storage space. Without enough space downloads may be stopped and the app may crash or say that it is unable to download. Next, remove and re-add Google account. Removing a Google account may sometimes fix Play Store errors. Make sure to do this if the problem has not gone away at this stage. Next, troubleshoot Google Services Framework. Google Services Framework app is one of the default Android apps and sometimes a problem in it can affect other apps. Try to reset Google Services Framework to defaults and see if it will help. Next, reset app preferences. Apps don't work in isolation. Oftentimes they require other apps or default services to function. Sometimes though a bug may disable a necessary default app. This may lead to problems for other apps or for Android in general. Next, refresh system cache. A corrupted system cache may cause a Play Store error. To find out if that's the case try clearing the cache partition. This will delete the system cache and hopefully fix the problem.
Next, observe on safe mode. In some rare cases, Play Store errors may actually be caused by a bad third-party app. To check, run your Galaxy S10 to safe mode. Third-party apps are suspended on safe mode so if the Play Store can download updates and apps that means that our suspicion is correct. Lastly, factory reset. Should nothing work after doing all the solutions consider wiping the phone with a factory reset. This will delete all personal data so be sure to back them up ahead of time. We hope this video is helpful to you. Please support us by clicking like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.